like to share with you uh, some of the news about the exciting clinical research that's been carried out at the Ottawa Regional Cancer Centre over the past couple of years. You know, we've engaged in a number of clinical trials, so two in particular, uh, where we've been involved with cutting-edge research that's really moved the, uh, the ball forward in terms of treating melanoma. One is with a new immune therapy called ipilimumab, and the other is with a set of targeted therapies that have been directed at the machinery of the cancer cell. These trials have been important for patients in our region because they've given them access to these drugs long before they'll be available on the general market. They've allowed us to gain experience with using the drugs so that we know how to manage the complications and most importantly of all, they've positioned us to step forward into the next generation of trials where we will attempt to build on these results. So running clinical trials is tremendously important but they're terribly expensive to do and we can't always run the trials that we want to run because of funding constraints. For example, the ipilimumab trial almost was not run in Ottawa. The reason is that we did not have enough funding to cover our startup costs. We were fortunately able to secure some funds from another source. It allowed us to cover our startup costs and we were able to make that trial available to patients in our region. Another example of the difficulties we face financially with clinical research is in a a recent trial we and all the other cancer centers in Canada were offered uh, to participate in. And this involves ipilimumab, that same drug that has shown good benefit in advanced disease. In this trial, we'll be using it to try to prevent recurrences of cancer. The problem is that the, the amount of funding that's being made available for this trial will not meet our costs and we will not be able in Ottawa to participate in that trial. Clinical research is tremendously expensive. Every time we open a study, we incur tremendous cost. We have to pay for the tests that are done for the patients on the trials. We have overhead costs, and most importantly, we have data management costs that have to be covered. Without outside support, we're not going to be able to run the trials that we should be running. We should not be deciding which trials to do on the basis of the per case funding. We should be looking at the science and the medical relevance of the trials. With your help, we'll be able to do that in Ottawa and bring to our region the type of cutting edge research that we require.